Welcome to the AJ Awesome Show, a show about my favorite things. My name is AJ, and my special guest for this episode is my friend, Mike Outlaw. I hope you like the show! It has been a really long time, almost 150 episodes, and over five years since I last interviewed Mike Outlaw. Wow, 150 episodes. That is crazy. That is crazy. I am welcoming again to my show, Mike Outlaw. Good to be back. Thanks for having me. Thank you for accepting. Anytime. What is the best thing about being a wrestler? The best thing about being a wrestler is being able to live out my dream that I've had ever since I was a kid and giving that same feeling back to the kids that that are in the crowd that I had when I was a kid and inspire them. That is the best feeling. You kind of gave me that feeling of I want to pursue my dreams whenever you wrestled in front of me. Man, that's cool. <laughs> the speech is awesome, man. If there was a movie about your life, who should play you? Hmm. That's a good question. Only There's only one Mike Outlaw, so if there was a movie about my life, Mike Outlaw should be Mike Outlaw. <laughs> it makes a lot of sense because nobody can be Mike Outlaw other than Mike Outlaw. Exactly. Who do you think the best wrestler in the world is right now? Hmm. It's all subjective, but my personal favorite, let me see, right now, AJ Styles is my personal favorite for right now. And in my opinion, he's the best wrestler in the world until he retires. He is a really good wrestler. Phenomenal. What is something about you that would surprise people? I guess that, I don't know, maybe that I'm more reserved and kind of quiet for a pro wrestler. As somebody that, you know, if, as a pro wrestler, you have to be larger than life and be very aggressive and out there. But like in my personal life, I'm just really chill and laid back. Because a lot of wrestlers have to be like, yeah, St. Louis! Uh, yes, that, that, was the, that was the perfect Mike Outlaw impression. <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather time travel to the past or to the future, and why? To the past. Um, there's loved ones that, that are not here that I would love to go see and spend some time with them. That's, that's really the main reason I'm... Um, as far as the future, I just want to let it happen and play out and see how it goes, but definitely the past. What is your favorite sport besides wrestling and your favorite team? My favorite sport to watch is probably football. I'm not a huge sports fan, but I would go with football. Um, favorite team? Whatever team Tom Brady's on. Tom Brady is kind of a cheater from what I heard. Well, he's kind of a champion too. I don't. I don't think he cheats. You know, you can't cheat that many times and get away with it. Yeah, that is true. In your opinion, who are some of the best undiscovered talent in wrestling? Hmm. Undiscovered talent in wrestling. There's a lot of them in the St. Louis scene right now. Um, my guys like um, All That Matters, ATM, uh, Chris Hendricks. Um, you got guys that come down to the dojo. Let me see, like, you got Camaro Jackson, Tootie Lynn, Ramsey, it was Seishin, Kenny Alfonso, um, Cody Lane, Ethan Price. Um, I'm just naming guys off the top of the dome that I'm around, like, often, and, like, they're really good and, and really should be out there and push more. Um, that's all I can think of at the moment. Because in the St. Louis scene, there is a lot of wrestlers that just don't get the recognition that they need. I 100% agree with you. Hopefully that changes real soon. If you could choose to have three wishes granted, what would you wish for? Hmm. A lot of money. That's one. 
Um, are these like any wish, any wish? Is there um, like a limit on these wishes, or you cannot ask for more wishes. Okay, that's the only wish. Um, a lot of money. By a lot, let's put a number: twenty million dollars. Um, <laughs> health and happiness for all my family and friends. Um, and probably world peace, you know, because there's a lot of crime and stuff going on in the world, unnecessary crime at that, that um, the world should be a better place if everybody just got along, so I'm going to go with that. I can agree. Yes, sir. Who were your inspirations in pro wrestling and why? Steve Austin and AJ Styles for two totally different reasons as I was growing up. Uh, I got into wrestling by, through Steve Austin. Uh, larger than life character, defiant, um, and then eventually I transitioned over to watching TNA, and I got into AJ Styles, who was phenomenal, who's athletic, who can do almost anything. So for two totally different reasons, I fell in love with Austin through character, and I fell in love with AJ through um, athleticism. Because Austin, I would say, inarguably, is one of the best of all time. The greatest of all time, in my opinion. That's the end. Thanks for the interview. Yeah. Bye. I hope you enjoyed this episode of the AJ Awesome Show. I would like to thank Mike Outlaw for being my special guest. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you next time.